the graph of sine of x from 0 to 2 pi looks like this. We will draw the tangent line at x equals 0. The tangent line seems to have a slope of 1. So, the graph of its derivative at x equals 0 will be equal to 1. Now, let's go ahead and start moving the tangent line towards pi over 2, the maximum value of the sine curve. The slope of the tangent line has a positive value, but it is decreasing and eventually attains a value of 0. So, the derivative at x equals pi over 2 is equal to 0. The graph of the derivative crosses the x-axis at this x value. Next, we move towards pi, and the slope of the tangent line is now negative and becomes more negative as we move towards x equals pi. The graph of the derivative will have negative outputs, and as the tangent line moves towards pi, the slope of the tangent line reaches a minimum and is equal to negative 1. So, the derivative's output will be equal to negative 1 at x equals pi.